Good morning, my dear friend. It's a wonderful Monday morning, sunny, bright, and beautiful. Hope your week goes very well. We are looking at Isaiah chapter 45 and verse 11. And this part of the chapter was prophetic to Cyrus, but it's very much applicable to us today as well. In verse 11, it says, Thus says the Lord, the Holy One of Israel, the one who formed him, ask me of things to come. Will you command me concerning my children and the work of my hands? And the Lord is posing a question here. He starts off by just saying who he is, the Holy One of Israel and the one who formed him. In other words, he is once again the original creator. That theme is coming again and again in this because we confuse that issue at times thinking we're in control. And he goes on to say, will you command me concerning my children and the work of my hands? In other words, are you going to question me? I'm the one that formed and created, but you're going to question me? And that's actually kind of a strong warning to all of us. You know, with the, the way the Lord is leading us at times, it's easy to question him and say, really, God, should you be doing this? But he wants us to rest in him. As we go to prayer today, let's just commit our way to him and accept what he's doing in us. Heavenly Father, we come to you thankful today. Lord, you are the creator of heaven and earth and of us. And so, Lord, we want all our ways committed to you. Lord, we don't want to ask foolish questions. We don't want to second-guess you. We want to accept what you have for us in Jesus' name. Amen.